I, uh, you're right. How's it going? We're back with Final Fantasy X, as you may have uh, observed. Now, we've just got to kill a Tempo. We met some annoying Blitzer, uh, Blitz ball players, Luka Goers. They're kind of like, you know, the big cheeses of Blitzball in Spira. They always win. And they weren't very nice to us, so hopefully we can kick their asses if the time comes. But um, we have got a bit of a uh, bit of a nice bit of close to a trials, bit of a nice, you know, close to a trials here. Close to a trials, bit of, you know, trials of cloisters. Oysters, you know, stuff. The faith is below. Let's do it. Okay. The faith? But first, the Cloister of Trials. Kamari, Waka, ready? Why do you say my name? Strength, everyone. In we go. Titus is like, yeah, I'll tag along. Look, and Kamari's like, no. nah, mate. <laughs> hey, what gives? You're not a guardian yet. Um, we'll be back as soon as we can, okay? What the hell am I gonna do in the meantime? Oh sure, soon, like tomorrow soon, I bet. Yeah, you could be forever in there. I mean, I've left me DS at home. What am I gonna do? To turn to tame myself? I left it back in Zanakind. Zanakind? <laughs> Zanakand. However you say it. Okay, so they've gone down there, and we've been abandoned. Which is fair enough, because we aren't you know, a guardian. But we did it in Besaid. Why can't we do it here? You know what? Fuck him. I'm gonna go down there as well. Where's you now? Oh, not you again. Then why are you here? Because I'm not a guardian. Hey, I'm not a guardian, so I'm not supposed to go in, right? Hmm. Not a guardian, you say? Yeah. So you know, I can't go down. Hey, hey what? Wait. What the hell are you doing, big oafish man? Who? <laughs> Probably can't say much. This this is just downright nasty. What's a big idea? Just a little game. I can see your eyes. You really do need to get some more clothes on. This is bad. Really bad. Yeah, I know, I mean now we've now we've um Oh wait, why can't we just Come on, go up! Go up! Why is it not going up? They must want us to, you know, decimate the teachings or whatever. Oh dear. Well, there's no point turning back now. I was going to go down here anyway. I mean, you can choose to wait here, but you'll be waiting for a very, very, very long time. And I'm talking about forever. So just go inside, please. Just do no yourself a favor. Allowed. I'm sure no guardian. It's too late now. It is really. Thanks to Donna and her uh, man slave. Ooh. Creepy music plays. We got uh, a sphere ahead of us and a big door. I wonder what we have to do here. Let's take it out. It is a Kilika sphere. Take sphere. Put it in the door. See a sphere shaped recess. Put it in. That's it. Oh shit, now we've burnt down a door. The temple priests are not gonna be happy. Take it out. Didn't mean to, wasn't me. Right. Now what do I do? Three different things here. I wonder which one I put it in. I'll try all of them. A glyph appears. Ooh. All right. So take the sphere. I reckon I have to put a glyph sphere in that. So we'll just chuck one here for now. 
go. Should uh, nothing should happen. Nope. All right, we'll try this then, shall we? The glyph sphere. Okay. No, don't push the damn thing. Didn't tell you to do that, did I? Glyph glows on the wall. The glyph repels you. Oh no. Oh no. So what do we do now? See, we'll try putting that in there. Then. Okay, now I'm stuck. Uh, hmm. I wonder. Can I touch the glyph? Aha, there we go. Right. And it opens the way to... A room of fire. Okay. Um, it's going to be pretty hot in here. The Titus isn't going to take off all his clothes. Hopefully not, anyway. Alright, what's this then? Uh, we got a panel there that looks like we need to put a pillar on it. We've also got a Kilika Sphere here. I wonder if I need to take that. Hmm. Okay, that did bugger all. Uh, <laughs> right, hang on, I'm going to refer to the guide. I was trying to do it by myself, but I can't be asked. Alright, let's have a look. Hear the pages turning, the cogs working here in my brain. Patterson, I really think there's Patterson sitting on the other side. Oh, I've done that. I didn't even, I didn't even know you had to do that. That's a lot of flames. Pencil up in. Ah, ha, 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 stand on this glowy glyph. That makes the pedestal appear in here. Then we put the Kilika sphere in. Put it in, man. Go. Right. Now what do we do? We can push it, but where do we have to push it? If we push us onto the glowing switch, part of the floor will vanish now. Right, okay, we can do that. We can do it. Pushing pedestals is what Titus does best. Oh yes. No, come on. Oh fucking hell. Push it, no, don't run past it. There we go. Good man. Wasn't that fucking hard, was it? Alright, let's push it a little bit over there. Okay. Then a little bit to the side. Alrighty then. I'm just straight up. Ooh, it's melting. It's making the floor disappear. And some has appeared down there again as well, but I can't really go down while all that fire's there, because we'll get burnt to a crisp. Crispy. Right, I think I need the glyph sphere now. I think I know where to put it. I'll put it in there. Why not? Ah ha ha ha! And the fire goes out. Excellent, Mundo. And we have the destruction sphere. But I think I need to get rid of this. Take the sphere. Right, I can go put that in the door up here. It's all coming together. It's all coming together. Certain sphere. That will burn the door down. And we grab this bad boy, the purple destruction sphere. It's kind of pinkish, really, isn't it? Kind of pinky purple. Lilac? Nah, not really lilac. Or maybe a little bit lilac-y. It don't matter anyway, we're going to put it in here. It's going to blow up. Oh yes. And we have the chest. The treasure of this temple. Red armlet. Who's that for? I know you. Who has armlets? Uh, you. Aha, it's Kimari. Red armlet, fire ward, ice ward, and lightning ward. Holy shit bags. 
That's fantastic. Well worth uh, getting there, and I reckon because it, HP's nice, but we'll, uh, it was only 5%, so we'll equip that. Reduce current HP, proceed, yes. Still 644, so not bad. Right then, we've done it. Just need to take this out. And be on our way. Oh, there we go. I think I did everything right there. Hopefully I did. Let me have a sip of me Coke. They are going to be pissed that we uh, <laughs> we followed them. Whoa, whoa, whoa! It was Donna and that big muscle head man. <laughs> Yuna will be the one to suffer the consequences. Uh, what consequences? She could be excommunicated. Oh shit! But we could just say, well, yeah, he is a guardian, and you know, keep it at that. Be easy to get around that, I'm telling you. I mean, we can fight. It's not as if, you know, we're just some random guy. Um, so we may have to speak to these people. They don't seem too impressed. Let's try and make friends again. Waka. Just wait. Just wait. So what's in there anyway? The faith, remember? Oh, yeah. <laughs> that thing, right. The faith are people who gave their lives to battle sin. Oh. Yevon took their souls, willingly given from their still living bodies. That sounds painful. Huh? Now, they live forever, trapped in statues. But when a summoner beckons, the souls of the faith emerge once again. That's what we call an Aeon. All that in this room? So, so, what's Yuna doing in there? She prays with all her heart for a way to defeat sin. Mm, seems like a, like a scary place. Like you, Lulu. The chamber beyond is a sacred place. Only summoners may enter. What? Even guardians can't go? It's taboo. Taboo. Oh. Love that word. It's taboo. Yeah, you know you like it as well. Uh, could speak to Kamari. Oh, oh! I didn't want to. I didn't want to go in. I'm just go and say hello. You didn't need to slap me. Oh, I could watch that over and over again. You know, that is so funny. I just want to have a look. No, okay. Okay. Lulu. Face palm. <laughs> she really isn't impressed. Impressed. Just wait. Just wait. I am waiting. Yee, nice lanterns with fire inside them. Right. No. Still can't go in there. Alright then. <laughs> I will stop trying eventually, Kamari. Don't you worry. But uh, not just yet. <laughs> we are gonna have one hell of a bruise there. All right, let's try going back. And uh, there she is. She looks bushed. There was something I didn't tell anyone else that day. That song we heard there in the temple, I knew it from my childhood. Really? It was proof that Spira and Xanarkin were connected, somehow. At least to me it was. Maybe that's why suddenly I felt like I just wanted to go home. I tried to say something to tell them, but the words wouldn't come. Mm. Yeah, I'd hate to be in Titus's position. You'd feel like just a, you know, the, the third wheel. You don't belong there and you just want to go home. But we have a new Aeon, possibly one of the um, one of my favourite sort of summons in the Final Fantasy series, Ifrit, or Ifrit, or Ifrit, or Ifrite, or Ifrit, or Ifrit, or whatever you want to call him. I'm just, I'm just going to call him Ifrit because that's all I have ever done. So I'll confirm. Proceed. Drink time. 
Ah, right, okay, we're back at the uh, the entrance. Let's... Let's have a mosey on up here. the flashback, is it? Certainly is. Oh, is this where he dances? Oh, this is, watch Titus dance here. This has got to be the coolest dance ever. My feelings for Zanarkin behind me. Look at him go. Yeah. What a douche. But they were there. And they grew inside me bigger and bigger, till I was just about ready to burst. Are... are you okay? I... I don't know. What do you want to do? To scream real loud? <laughs> Everyone shits themselves. Yeah. Sometimes you just gotta do that though, you just gotta let it all out, aren't you? It's uh, very therapeutic to do that. It's good for you. Oh, so I'm told. Stops uh, stomach ulcers. Apparently. I don't know. Maybe that's just made up. Maybe I just made that up myself without realising it. Who knows? Oh, another battle. But we could actually test out our Aeon now. Our new Aeon, which I'm going to do. You guys are toast! You there's only one of them, Titus. Silly man. Can't even count, right? Uh let's swap to unit and we're gonna summon. Oh by the way, her overdrive is a grand summon, which summon summons an Aeon with its overdrive already. So you could in theory have an Aeon that has two overdrives, one after the other. But we're just going to summon Ifrit. He's got over a... Oh, nice. I didn't... Yeah, 1087. Very nice. Let's summon him. And we're going to see the uh, the long animation here for the first time. It's pretty damn cool. Whoopie Pops, look at that. Catches Yuna. What a beast. Oh, oh. Will you help us? Well, if he turns on us, we're pretty much screwed, because he would destroy us. Let's uh let's try his meteor strike attack. This guy's weak against fire, so we're gonna do some nice damage. Boom. And um, because if it is a fire aeon, if we cast fire on him. It will heal him. So we'll try and build up his, uh, his overdrive here. Uh, we got, ooh, we got white magic as well. Fire, so if we can cast it on ourselves. We heal ourselves. How cool is that? Yep, you build up our overdrive, buddy. Gonna boost. Come on, yep. Attack me! Excellent. Now we'll just quickly heal ourselves again. Do, 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 do. do almost there. What? We don't need to boost, do we? We shouldn't need to. Heal myself again, just for laughs. I just want to show you his overdrive, that's all. There we go. Now you're fucked, buddy. Because we are going to cast Hellfire. Watch this. Oh, ho, ho. 
and ready for the big finale. We'll chuck some dirt at him. And, uh, granted, a big, big, big bit of dirt, but still. Overkill. Oh, yeah. Nice necklace as well. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay, so any more random battles I'm gonna skip. Please don't be any more, please don't be any more, please don't be any more, please don't be any more. In fact, no, I'll have to look up here quickly. I didn't uh, I didn't explore this area. I completely forgot, and I don't know if there is anything up here. Uh, I'll finish you off dead quick. I will be showing everyone's overdrive eventually, but um, I'm going to save them for bosses. Oh, do we have dirt? Oh, yeah, we do have dirt. Touch, don't we? That's, uh, I'm just looking at a spear now. That's a pretty cool looking spear. Lulu and Yuna didn't get any XP there, but I'm not too fussed. I've done my grinding in this area. Seeker's shield. A quick look. In fact, we'll just uh, use up this S level right down there. And Tidus has got a bit more MP for himself. Uh, what was I going to do? Equip. Yeah, so that's HP plus 5%, but I reckon the defense is probably a bit more handy at the moment. Bit more handy. I'm going this way. Anything up here? There must be. There must be somewhere. There we go. There is a chest, but uh, unfortunately, this inconsiderate bunch of enemies has decided to attack us. That's it, Walker. You tell him, boy. Overkill. Very nice. And we're going to get an overkill on this guy. What did I tell you? any of these bonus weapons that we're finding, we can always just sell if we're a bit short on cash. Luxphere. Ah, I'm glad I didn't I didn't forget about that because that's gonna be handy. Oh more MP for Walker as well coming up. And what's the next ability he's gonna learn? Dark Buster. That's good. Return. Right. Now I shall uh, I shall see you back at the entrance to this jungle, because there's probably going to be a few random encounters. Right then, we're, uh, we're at the entrance. Let's leave. On to Luca, I think. Uh, this guy's uh, still hammering away. Someone named Donna passed through here a while ago. She'll probably be taking the ferry. Oh, don't tell me she's going to be on the same boat as us. That is going to suck. What about you? What are you doing? See, sure looks beautiful from here, but something's lurking out there somewhere. Yeah, that's a creepy, creepy thought. Look at it. He's still chilling. He's not doing anything, this guy. He's not smiling all the killer, thanks to Sin. If we win the next tournament, that should cheer everyone up. Well, good luck to you, like I said before. speak to them? No, I can't. In fact, before we leave, I'll just uh, quickly check the shop again. I'm not trying to touch your merchandise, and that is dirty. Right, let's, uh, let's sell. What can we sell? Anything? We have the Rod of Darkness. I don't think I'm ever going to use that. That would sell for a decent amount of money, so... Yep. And what else have we got? What else have we got? Harpoon. That's only 12. That's not worth worth selling. 
Although, uh, I am going to sell it anyway because it clears up space. Light shield, slow ward. That's interesting. And I reckon I'll leave it at that. Just give us a bit of extra money here. Embark. Ah, right, okay. Well, I reckon I'm going to end the video here then. And in the next one, we're going to embark on our voyage to Luca. Finally. So, uh, thanks for watching. And I shall see you in a bit.